Mastering everyday English. Hanging up clothes, explained. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to our channel, where we dive into the fascinating world of English language learning. Today, we're going to unravel the meaning behind a common everyday phrase, hanging up clothes. This simple task is something many of us do regularly, but understanding the phrase's components and usage can greatly enhance your English skills. Let's get started. Hanging up clothes refers to the action of placing clothes on a hanger or a line to dry or store them. This phrase encompasses two main activities. Drying clothes after washing and storing clothes neatly in a closet or wardrobe. It's a practical phrase that finds its way into daily conversations, especially when discussing chores or organizing living spaces. 1. Hanging. This part of the phrase implies suspending something from a higher position. When we talk about clothes, hanging allows them to retain their shape and prevents wrinkles. 2. Up. While up might seem like a direction, in this context, it suggests the action of raising something to a higher position or state. 3. Clothes. This term refers to items of wearing apparel. It can include shirts, pants, dresses, and other garments that one might wear. Combining these elements, hanging up clothes, involves lifting clothes to a higher position for drying or storage, ensuring they are ready for future use. Understanding and using phrases like, hanging up clothes, can significantly improve your ability to perform everyday tasks in English-speaking environments. It's not just about the action itself, it's about integrating into daily life and conversations. Whether you're living in an English-speaking country or just looking to enhance your language skills, knowing these practical phrases is invaluable. To help you grasp how to use this phrase, here are a few examples. After washing my laundry, I spend some time hanging up clothes to dry. Could you help me by hanging up the clothes in the closet? I prefer hanging up my clothes rather than folding them because it keeps them wrinkle-free. There you have it, a simple yet thorough exploration of the phrase, hanging up clothes. We hope this video has shed light on how such everyday expressions are significant in mastering English. Remember, it's the small details that often make the biggest difference in language learning. Thank you for watching, and we look forward to bringing you more useful content. Happy learning!